For this video, I'm doing without my microphone, and to the alternate corner I come, but not on camera. Find me dinner first. Quentin Tarantino has called this his favourite movie. It's one of mine as well. And I don't feel like I need a reason to watch it this year. From Kinchi Fukusaku, famed for making the Japanese side of the war movie Tora 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 and many Yakuza classics, came an immortal controversy. His last masterpiece, Battle Royale. <laughs> Politicians are losing control, youth crime is rising, many children are not going to school at all. For instead of looking for viable alternatives and fearing the worst, the government passed the Millennium Reform Act, aka Battle Royale. One class from over half a million schools nationwide is selected to take part in a game of attrition. 42 students are taken to a secluded island given food, provisions, weapons, and must fight and kill each other until there is one left standing. They can't escape either. They're all fitted with a special necklace. Now this kind of neckwear has been seen before. It's not gonna make it. That collar's gonna blow. Chico! Star making roles from Tetsuya Fujiwara and Chiaki Kuriyama, they will go on to appear in other high profile movies and they're watched over by the living legend Takeshi Kitano. Mitsuko, Shineo, Busu. This is the kind of story that stands as wisdom and warning. The acts of totalitarian power. Look what's happening in Iran, a female uprising to the arrogant out of touch regime. The war in Ukraine. Movies and shows from other mediums from 1984 to V for Vendetta. Then you have the, how can I say? The Hunger Games, a teenage friendly version of Battle Royale. How the Americans like to put a spin on something that's so popular. A sanitized version of an international controversy. Having said that, author Susan Collins said she'd never heard of Battle Royale when she turned in her manuscript eight years after its original release. Two years before it was finally released in America. But the similarities are there. Something that was so well publicised and championed by Quentin Tarantino who wanted everybody in the West to see it. Whatever your feelings to Battle Royale, it does bear resemblance to A Clockwork Orange and Lord of the Flies. It stands as an unstoppable masterpiece of extreme cinema.